Hey Libra, what's up? Welcome to your reading. So this is going to be a love reading. We're going to have a look at your past, present and future of your connection. I will wait for you till eternity regardless of how painful it will be. So this person is ready to wait for you forever, no matter how painful it is. I will wait for divine timing to unite us. So this person out here has a lot of hope, a lot of high hopes and faith that you guys will come back together eventually, which is telling me that you guys are in separation. There could be a lack of communication here. We are twin flames. This is an eternal bond. Bond. So this person here definitely knows that you guys are twin flames, okay? This person here feels a very deep soulmate twin flame connection to you, okay? I love the way you nurture me. So you're definitely dealing with someone here who probably you have been very, very loving and caring about, okay? And you've cared for this person like a mother, like a father, like a parent, okay? And this person loves that about you, okay? They love the way you care. They love the way you uh, nurture them, okay? Yeah. So the past year, we have the Four of Cups, the Strength, and the Two of Wands here. There was definitely someone here, okay, who probably, um, you, there was a lack of emotional fulfillment in the past is what I'm getting here, okay? And this person here kept breadcrumbing you, okay? And uh, this person here probably did give you the love and attention that you deserved, Libra. You probably had to do all the work out here is what I'm getting here. And someone had to make a choice. Someone was at a crossroads out here, but refused to make a decision here. Yeah, but there was a lack of uh, happiness, emotional fulfillment out here. Okay. In the current situation, we have the four, the ten of cups, and the nine of swords. Someone definitely sees you as the one for them. Okay. They want a, a happily ever after. They want a family with you. They see you as someone who they have a lot of happiness with. This person here does want a new beginning with you. They want to take a leap of faith and come towards you. But whatever the situation is, the situation is like something that involves a lot of worry and anxiety, okay? Because this person here probably didn't make a decision in the past out here. They know that they screwed up, which could be one of the reasons why it was a missed opportunity and you walked away from them, okay? Because I'm getting here as you doing all the work in the connection and this person just doing nothing about it, okay? They kept you at a crossroads out here. And now this person's very worried of whether you're going to take them back or whether you're there still, if you're still on for this new beginning with them, yes or no. Give me the future. Wow. Nice. So in the future here, I do feel that there is going to be an opportunity here of having a promising new beginning between you both here, okay? But someone is going to be in two minds. Let's see. We're going to have to clarify and see what's really going on, okay? Uh, bottom of the deck, we have the three of cups here. So there is a potential of a reconciliation here, okay, between you both here. But we'll see, which I'm already getting here. We'll see if that happens, okay? So let's clarify for the four of cups why is there so much of could, could be someone here who felt rejected maybe you made this person an offer and you felt rejected because this person was not giving uh not taking up that offer yeah Pentacles, a high priestess yeah so uh i feel that um you probably walked out of this person here like I said, there was a missed opportunity here because this person here kept bread coming. You kept you bits, give you bits and pieces to keep you around in the situation here. Okay. Probably you just walked away from this person very quietly and silently. You probably didn't even tell this person what you felt and you just chose to walk away. Maybe because that is what your intuition was telling you. You just chose to move forward. Can I have the two of wands here? So I feel here that in the in the past here, the connection was extremely strong between you both, okay? It was like a twin flame connection with the lovers here and this is what this person knows. There was a strong twin flame connection between you both here. Almost, it was, it could have been a marriage. It could have been a relationship. It could have just been a very, very strong spiritual connection between you both, which was as good as a commitment out here. And someone wanted forward movement, okay? Someone out here wanted a label on the connection or wanted more success and victory out here. But the problem here was that that one person needed to make a choice about what they wanted to do, if they wanted to move forward in this connection or not. And I think that's something that didn't happen, which is why you probably walked away from that. Um, 
in the current in the current situation let's clarify the fool try for the fool please Although there are a lot of conflicts between you both here in the current situation here, there is somebody who's still holding on to you very tight. Okay, this person here does not want to let you go. They want to take a new beginning with you. They want to take a risk. They want to start a new chapter with you after there was an ending in the past out here. Okay, there are a lot of conflicts here. This person could be going back and forth in their head about wanting this with you. Yes or no? Again, because I'm getting the nine of swords twice, which is telling me that there's too much worry around. Okay, this person could have really screwed up between you both badly. Okay, and uh, because of which this. Person here has constant worry okay they're obsessing over the thought about what do i do next is libra gonna accept me is libra gonna take me back does libra have someone else you know that obsessive thinking okay which is leading to a lot of negativity manifesting into reality here but this person definitely is nuts over you nine of swords clap for the nine of swords in the current situation okay there was a card that flipped okay So this person here now is wanting to fix the situation with you. All right. This person here wants to balance things out out here. Okay. And um, they see you as someone who's very, very confident. Okay. So like I said, you could have walked away from them. Okay. Now you're at that very, uh, very uh, confident state of mind. Okay. They see you as someone who has a lot of suitors also probably, but you're coming off as someone here who's like, you know what? I don't give a shit. I'm doing me, all right? I realize my worth. I realize my value, okay? And all your focus is on yourself, okay? And this is something that is stressing this person out here, okay? Uh, this person here wants to heal the situation, okay? Like we saw. Uh, this person definitely wants to heal the situation here, okay? They want to make things right between you both. I'm yet feeling that this person in the current situation hasn't still communicated what they feel for you or what they want to do with you, but it is absolutely on their mind. Okay, they have been resting, rejuvenating, okay, trying to take a break, okay, and trying to stay detached from you. But honestly, they're not resting in true in true terms, they're not resting. In fact, they're overthinking, they're reaching a point of burnout, okay, because they don't know how to make it right with you. Because honestly, the fact that you're coming off as so confident to them and the fact that you're coming off as someone who doesn't give a shit to them is getting them even more intimidated. Um let's clarify the Queen of Wands in the future. So yes, let's see. What's the Queen of Wands here? Yeah. Uh, like I said, so in the future here, this person here is going to come towards you. There is going to be a potential here, an opportunity here of a promising new uh, beginning between you both. Okay. This person is going to come towards you, offering you something that holds a lot of potential, holds a lot of stability and security. It may be a small offer, but again, it is just an opportunity. Okay. Like it's coming from the universe. It's coming out of nowhere. Okay. So you're going to have an opportunity here, like I said, to reconcile here. But I feel that you are probably going to be in two minds here, like we see here, because you see this person as someone, you know, who you've tried things in the past with. It's not worked out. Okay. And this person kind of disappointed you over and over again. Uh, this person is a very easy come easy go here that's how you view this person as either a player or someone here you know who's very on and off and very unreliable out here and honestly overall you do these you do see the situation as something where you know what there's too much work here that you've done in this connection you're the one who takes on a lot of responsibilities while the other person does nothing about it okay which is why you probably are going to be into minds about wanting to reconcile with this person or take them back okay because there's a lot of pain uh, probably this person's lied or probably even cheated on you. Probably there's been deception out here. Okay, so you're just not sure if you want to trust this person and give them another chance. What's the two of pentacles here? Honestly, I don't need to clarify that, but I'll still do it for you. Why is the two of pentacles here? Try for the two of pentacles here. I feel that this opportunity that's going to come in in the future here, there is a potential of having a long-term commitment with this person out here. But the problem lies because you're going to be over-analyzing, over-thinking, and uh, probably even going to be very defensive, okay? And very interrogative when this person comes in towards you, okay? Either with their communication, you're going to constantly have trust issues with them, okay? Or you're just not going to trust the issue. You're just not going to trust the communication. You just don't trust them. Honestly, the offer is going to be something which is going to be long term. Okay, but you're I, I just feel like you're just like in two minds awarded. You may even choose to sabotage this opportunity and walk away completely.
okay so that's what i have for you libra hope this reading resonates it's going to be up to you the potential of the reconciliation is coming in it's absolutely up to you if you want to give this person a second chance all right bye bye